Just 20 athletes have represented the Australian Bells at the Paralympic Games. So it is a prestigious and exclusive club. And now, without further ado, it's time to induct its newest members. To qualify for one Paralympics is amazing, but to qualify for three, not many people can say that, so it's such an honour. I think it's everybody's dream, isn't it? <laughs> I don't know how to express it, it's amazing and I'm so excited. This is something I've worked towards for over eight years now, so it's exciting that it's finally finally paying off. It's honestly one of the most incredible experiences to be able to, ex to go on this journey with my dad. I wouldn't be here today if he hadn't helped me throughout that. So I'm, I'm really excited and grateful to be sharing this experience with him. I'm oh, very, very proud and excited. As uh, Brody said, it's a lot of hard work over a lot of years. But uh, to finally get to the Paralympics, it's going to be very exciting. It's really sad for Jenny Blow and for Peter Kaur, the head coach of this team, not to be able to be here physically for the announcement. Those two are just amazing influences on this team. Jenny, this will be her third Games, and Peter, who's been involved in Paralympic sport for four decades now, and has really built them up from the ground up. The Bells are just such an amazing team. It's been awesome from my perspective to see them grow from the London 2012 Games where they came back after a 12 year hiatus. They are genuine elite athletes and have a genuine chance of making a big splash at the Games in Tokyo. Expect everything and anything and nothing I think and for me that's also exciting because it puts me as on the same level as everybody else. Everybody's expecting the unexpected and that's kind of cool. <laughs>